To get your driver's license, you have to pass both the theory and practical exams issued by DVLA. This is available to both new drivers and experienced drivers who require a driving license in Ghana. All who apply for the DVLA driving license for the first time are required by the DVLA regulations to first apply for the learner's driver's license after which the actual driver's license would be issued. Experienced drivers or those who previously owned driver's licenses issued by DVLA do not have go through this process. According to procedure, a learner driver's license has to be acquired for a period of three months before you can apply for the actual license. The cost of a new driving license in Ghana is around 257 Ghanaian CD. Requirements for getting a new driving license in Ghana Your physical at any DVLA office nationwide. You must be minimum of 18 years of age. You must have a basic education, maybe's, or adult education, ability to read and write. Please note that experienced drivers do not need to follow this process. If you have a temporary driver's license, you need to get the permanent driver's license after 3 months. The cost of this driver's license is around 257 Ghanaian CD. Also, you need this. Passport pictures. Types of driving license slash classes of driving license in Ghana. We have six types or classes of driving license in Ghana, which are 1. Class A, for drivers who drive motorcycles 2. Class B, for drivers who can drive minibuses, pick up vehicles that contain 1 to 15 passengers 3. Class C, for drivers who can drive buses with moderate goods 4. Class D for drivers who drive coaches and heavy-duty vehicles and buses, the vehicle must contain 1 to 65 passengers. 5. Class E for those who drive industrial equipment like harvesters, bulldozers, forklifts, etc. 6. Class F for drivers who can drive heavy-carrying vehicles like articulators, etc. How to get a new driver's license in Ghana First purchase and complete forms F and F1 from the DVLA. You will then undergo a physical examination and eye test. You will be issued a learner driver's permit, airplate, syllabus and highway code after payment. You will undergo a compulsory 48-hour training with a DVLA accredited driving school. Afterwards your biometric information will be captured and you will be scheduled for written test which takes the following forms, written exams, computer-based test. You will then undergo oral examination, then you will undergo in traffic test. You will then make payment of the driver's license and plate fees. Your driver's license will be captured, then issuance of temporary driver's license and plate. Afterwards, you will be issued the actual driver's license. How to register slash apply for a driver's license on the online DVLA portal. To register for a driver's license on the DVLA online portal, first sign into the DVLA online portal at online.dvla.gov.gh slash sign underscore in. Then enter the username and password you created during the account registration process above. Afterwards, click the sign in button. You will be successfully signed into the DVLA online portal. You can now access the DVLA online service that allows you to register for a driver's. How long does it take to get a new driving license in Ghana? After going through the stated procedures, you are going to have your driving license processed within time. You will receive your new driver's license within months to three months. What is the cost of driver's license in Ghana? According to the new tariffs. Note that these fees are subject to downward or upward review. A new driving license costs 257 Ghanaian CD. Replacement of an expired license, renewal, costs 155 Ghanaian CD. License upgrade cost 345 Ghanaian CD. Replacement of lost driving license cost 205 Ghanaian CD.
conversion of a foreign driving license will cost 445 Ghanaian CD. The cost of a learner's permit is 160 Ghanaian CD. Road sign test is 50 Ghanaian CD and the driving test is also 50 Ghanaian CD. This brings us to the end of this post about how you can get your driver's license in Ghana, what do you think about the video and the process involved? Let us know what you think via the comment section. Thank you for watching this video and we hope you found some valuable information, please do not forget to subscribe, like and share this video.